Hello friends, after my successful participation in Title Tuesday two weeks ago, I got a warm message from chess.com. The message was saying congratulations on your impressive run or something like that. And first I thought like maybe like since I took seventh place, but there are five prizes, who knows, maybe something happened and I won a prize or something like that but then it was saying that your performance has qualified you for fair play check dear alexander congrats on your recent run in early title tuesday on november 14th your performance has qualified you for our fair play checks this is our standard protocol to safeguard the integrity of the event no one is exempt so for your next two title Tuesday, you will be asked to play on camera and blah, 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 blah. Actually, cheating is the reason why I don't usually participate in title Tuesdays. And uh, here I just played because I wanted to, to get some practice before the World Rapid and Blitz Chess Championships. And I played well, beating uh, Duda, Nihal, Matlakov and... Uh, a few other people but weaker of course i was lucky and uh, you can check my one of my previous video where i was showing these games fortunately i recorded that video before getting um, that message and uh, since i had no choice next tuesday i joined a uh, zoom call and was playing on camera the problem that um, i don't think playing on camera um, helps to find cheaters let's say if i showed a good performance in the previous tournament and they asked me to play on camera in the next one so how does it help joining the zoom call i saw that like uh, like two t two title tuesdays in a row i saw that actually there there are some uh, like, I don't know weak players because uh, a few of them I haven't ever seen maybe they ask people who showed a good performance or performance above their level or this is a random check I don't know but anyway I think it doesn't really help and on the other hand playing in zoom is very very annoying for me like at least for me but I think for other people as well uh, so what happened in the first title Tuesday that I played on camera, like my connection was just uh, dead because of that Zoom, because they record the event. And I played in the same place uh, from like all my settings were the same when I played um, a good tournament and a bad tournament on camera, the first tournament on camera. And here you can see uh, like a few screenshots uh, when... Uh, some games I was just losing half a minute. One of the games I started uh, having one minute 30 seconds and I realized that only somewhere in the middle of the game. Even there I still was uh, like on, like playing bad, badly but uh, uh, showing more or less good result. I had maybe 6 out of 8 if I'm not mistaken but then I lost... Uh, a game and then it was already nothing interesting while my second uh, tournament i decided to uh, change location uh, to play with a better internet so solving that problem at least it was still about um, seeing this uh, like window from the zoom and so on uh, still annoying uh, but what is good i showed a good result uh, i still scored uh, 9 out of 11, sharing second place, okay, 8th on tiebreak. However, not really beating anybody strong in that uh, title Tuesday. Okay, like I won 3 games uh, in the end of tournament, uh, beating maybe like a few 2600 OTB players. And later I got a message, Dear Alexander, thank you for successfully completing our fair play checks. Successfully completing. Then when players like yourself follow our protocols, it sets a massive example for others and ensures that no player is above the process. Good luck in future title Tuesdays. 
Thank you, but the only problem that it doesn't help at all, I believe like, okay, what, playing on Zoom with camera, like one camera, you don't even have to turn on your microphone, they turn off it themselves. So it can be anything, it can be something in your ear, it can be somebody there, just uh, like behind the computers or like, <laughs> uh, Actually, they okay. They I think they asked to show the room, but okay, somebody can uh, uh, go in, like join me later. Yes, so I don't really understand how it helps, but it's for sure uh, worsen my result because uh, like first title Tuesday and uh, like playing on camera was like terrible like not internet connection but because of doom because of like jumping out jumping in and so on it was very bad and uh, like even the second tournament you know like having that window um like it's very distracting yeah and the point the point is that to show good result in blitz it's all about like last seconds so in last seconds you should be focused you should play fast and then there is something distracting. I don't really understand how to play well. Even though, like, we can say I did that. Unfortunately, nowadays, uh, I don't really see a way to fight with cheating, especially online. Even in those tournaments, in solid tournaments, when you play with two camera, it's still, I think, uh, like, uh, I believe there are players who cheat there. In Title Tuesday, I don't know how many, but uh, for sure people cheat. Uh, even like OTB tournaments nowadays, people cheat like what? Unfortunately, there is no way to to stop that.